Yeah. We've got everyone. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Is there anything that you've come for to look at specially today? Prams. Okay. Oh my God, no look. You've got a steering wheel. <laughs> it's a buggy board for you to sit on. <laughs> when you're having a new baby, to get a new pram is the most important thing really, isn't it? But this time, they're not pram shopping for Sue. Go like that. Sticking out. Go like that. It's for Millie, Noel and Sue's 19-year-old daughter. She's due to give birth in less than a month. Do you remember what I used to say? Oh, I just want a bum. Now I'm like this, like struggling to fit in anything. I don't. I can't... You do actually look like you've dropped a little bit though. When I found out, I was very shocked. When I told mum, she was like, you're joking. I was like, no. Mum used to sit there watching labour programmes and I used to say, I'm never doing that. You'll never see me doing that. And here I am four weeks away from doing that. Do you think I'll be a wimp when I'm giving birth? For the first few bits, you'll be fine. And then when it comes to, like, nearer the end, that's when you just be like, I can't. I don't know how I'm going to do it. But, yeah, four weeks away from doing it. I mean, we were quite surprised, weren't we? Yeah, because she was always the one that was like, no, not no, having any. Never having them. I'd be too scared. I'm manifesting, saying out loud, it'll be a breeze, don't worry about it, Millie, it'll be fine. Ten minutes, it'll be over. So if I keep saying that, it'll come true. Yeah. Millie might be nervous, but the rest of the Radford brood are right behind her. I think Millie will be a good mum because she's really nice to, to us. She's going to be a good one for that baby. Yeah. They will love each other. These are the eye candy ones. I was trying to think about this the other day, how many prams we've actually gone through. It's and minimum I... 30. 30 no, prams. No, I don't think it is. Yeah, it is. Probably more than what's in this shop, to be honest. It's the day before Millie's baby shower. Big sister Chloe spent weeks planning the party. The centrepiece of the event is a specially ordered cake. But Noel's had a mishap on the way home from picking it up. Look at the chicken thing, it's knackered. It doesn't look quite as good as what it did when I picked it up, to be honest. Two or three minutes from home, somebody stopped in front of us in a roundabout. So I've had to jump on the panic pedal and the cake slid forward. Just a disaster. Why don't I, right, when I'm walking in, just pretend to drop it? Say, yes, I fell. No, because no, because knowing you, you'll end up dropping it properly. Oh, God, it wobbled. It's falling off already. Wish me luck. Ooh. I don't want to put it down. What have you done to the car? No, move for you. Car stopped in front of me. <gasps> oh no, what have you done? Don't look at it! Look at that bloody side. <laughs> Daddy put it under chairs and then it cracked. Don't worry. No, I'm really It will all be fine. I'm so annoyed. Oh. Look, that's just such a mess. It's such a mess. <laughs> She's definitely gonna crack. That is not gonna be good. I've been so excited to see that cake and they've brought it in and, it's, and it looks like that. I don't understand why no one was holding it. Imagine that cake in my head and they've, it's ruined. That is so bad. And with the baby shower tomorrow, it's too late to replace the cake. <gasps> don't you dare lunge forward, don't you dare. Actually, get down, get down. You're not having the cake. So Chloe's crying over the cake, and she's having a tantrum upstairs. And I'm looking at a cake that's completely smashed in. Please. Sit there and guard that cake whilst I go and sort Archie out. OK. No. Uh, no, 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 no. Millie. Hey. It's the day of Millie's baby shower. Hurry up. Phoebe, guess what? Millie's having a baby in two weeks. Yeah, yeah. It's just mad that you're going to have a baby. I know. Like, whenever I see you and you, you be massive bumps there, I just think, whoa. Chloe has shed blood, sweat and tears organising the event. 
<laughs> oh, wow. Beautiful. Wow. You walk in them better than I do. Thank you. Yes, I love my makeup, Chloe. Especially over that cake. Easy. Do you know what? Looking at it now, you probably wouldn't be able to tell that we had a disaster. <laughs> but no, yeah, it looks fine. I know it's only cake, but I want it to look nice. <laughs> That's why we're having this <laughs> shot. <laughs> Yeah? Yeah. That's nice. Everything's looking good, and the guests are due any time. have five minutes to get ready. Back at the house, they're nowhere near ready. Is that it, Millie? Full speed. Is that as fast as you can go? When it comes to a crisis, everyone mucks in. Well, I've just gone upstairs and I noticed Sue's... This is what she's wearing today. It looked like it needed ironing, so I thought I'll just quickly do it, cos she isn't going to have time to do it. Yeah, she's in just such, such, such a rush. Oh, it's not even see-through, which I'm glad. Five minutes, I usually get to get ready. I am really looking forward to today, because it'll be the older girls, which is really nice. We're not going to have children around, so it'll be lovely. Right, bye, bye. She's 15 minutes late and she's not still not set off. Sorted. I'm done. There's no hiding that. Um, we were supposed to be there 20 minutes ago. Because it's already 20 past. We do real. Fashionably late, Millie and her entourage arrive. Let's see the cake. It's the first time Millie's seen the cobbled together cake. It doesn't look that bad. Okay, good. <laughs> I cried uh, over this cake. She did not just once, actually, she cried twice. <laughs> oh my twice. god. And Millie's really chuffed with the cake, which is good. All good. It worked out yeah. all right in the end. Yeah. Oh, Millie. Oh, that's so good. Oh, Millie. Millie, do you feel like yeah. this is paparazzi on you? Millie, yeah. Yeah. Millie, <laughs> <laughs> Millie stay there. I didn't get one yet. Yeah. The baby shower was very special because there was four generations of women. There was my mum, there was me, there was Millie, and then there was Heidi. So, yeah, there was four generations. That's three. Because Millie's in the same generation as Heidi, is she not? Our daughter. Just saying. Well, this is what Wait, happens when there's so many of us. At 26, Sophie is the oldest of the Radford girls. It's really exciting. I'm really excited. I can't wait. But it's great, especially because like, you're a young mum and you've got your mum. Like, and she's obviously the perfect role model. It is a responsible... She, she won't all be a bed of roses. Babies are hard work, aren't they? I already know. We've had babies nearly every other year, haven't we? Yeah, pretty much, Renana. Yeah, and they're all happy, as long as they're happy and healthy. It's all you can have with babies. They're lovely. And a happy mum is a happy family, isn't it? Yeah. Big knickers. <laughs> they're very big. It's going really well. Yeah. Obviously, Millie's got time with her friends after today. She won't see them now until Ophelia's here, so. Yeah, but no, it's been nice. Wait, get some cake. Everything.